just a simple device or small mobile phone can save the children's life is it possible yes it is possible one 13 year child from iraq he is very happy to join the online session through mobile phone he said that it is really helpful to using the whatsapp mobile joining in the pss and education classes because it help us to understand how to maintain the social distance and how to protect from spreading coronavirus and it protects us from danger because we are attending the the station through online through phone and another child says that we didn't have anything to do in our house because schools are closed group activities are closed so this is one very good way to keep continue our education our learning yes iraq is also very much affected badly affected by spreading coronavirus children are facing crisis and this coronavirus brought another crisis to them the life is not easy there there are lots of moment restriction no activities they can participate they can enjoy they can uh, feel calm and relaxed and this is the one way a uh, watch child uk with the support of coordinating efforts from different child protection agency we came together with some solution in the meantime watail also did a lot of program adaptation in our gbb in our education in our protection program we try to come together and provide a good solution to the children and their family so we are providing our pfa services to calling to the beneficiary we are organizing a pss and education session using the workshop our case worker they are approaching to the beneficiary through phone they are doing the assessment they are doing follow up and they are also uh, referring to the other agency to provide child protection response to the case management children were also feeling happy to join in workshop sports session that we organized with them they were also benefited a series of awareness session we utilized through the social media these things were uh, not easy uh, in the beginning we faced a lot of challenges the first challenge about access to internet access to this ict because some of the family they, they didn't have any devices to connect their children in such online session and if any any family they have the devices but they don't have the connection to the internet so this was the the bigger challenge we face and the another challenge what we can we can share here in the beginning family they were very much reluctant to uh, give permission their children to join in such online classes giving them uh, their children to their own mobile phone because this is the new kinds of situation they were facing i didn't have any idea how to deal that and this ict thing was a uh, quite new for them so in the beginning they were really reluctant even when we try to uh, distribute our home pack uh, in the family they were saying please don't come in our house we are very much afraid with spreading this uh, corona virus that's why we applied this online uh, session and communicating through the phone so they feel uh, somehow a uh, calm uh, the agency the, whatever they are doing it is uh, keeping uh, safe them and their family connecting with this uh, mobile phone and organizing the online classes so these days situation are Uh, not uh, control but it is being calm people they are they are used to uh, join uh, such kinds of online cl- classes and also connecting uh, uh, through the phone 
but that is not enough. You have lots of things to do uh, in the future. There are lots of way forward. The first very important thing is how to create the access to the beneficiaries in the ICT. And uh, it is about uh, connectivity. It is about the, the free services. So we have to raise our common voice. And another uh, thing is very important. Uh, we have to come with some kinds of holistic approach to provide them support, linking with uh, uh, livelihood, uh, linking with GBB, education, and protection. So there are other sectors we need to uh, really uh, closely uh, work together. And this is the situation that we uh, keep in our mind. We have to utilize whatever resource we have at the moment. What are the way, what are the modality we can better support to the children. And at the moment, the, the distance support is uh, really uh, working well. And uh, we have to uh, continue this approach uh, in coming days. And yes, it is true that mobile phone protecting children's lives. So that is proof that children are being safe, children are not in danger of connecting with the, the, uh, the virus, and they, are, they have not uh, fear of uh, infection. Uh, you are most, most welcome if you have any questions. Thank you very much.